What is going on, Incarnate Nation? Welcome to a Battlefield 4 gameplay commentary. I'm playing with my friend on Zabod, and we are going around on the train tracks, confusing the hell out of enemies. I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay. Today's commentary is going to be about Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. The reason why I haven't made this video sooner is because I didn't want to jump on the hype train when the leak came out. It was an awesome trailer, but really it's just a single player campaign trailer. They didn't show any multiplayer. Of course, they never show multiplayer until around August, uh, closer to the release date uh, in November. So we didn't get to see anything. Uh, we just got to see uh, Kevin Spacey and that's pretty cool. But I find that a lot of these developers nowadays Ever since Call of Duty became this mainstream game, uh, it's the largest selling game in entertainment history. Um, ever since it became that, they've hired actors to uh, play these characters, and they've hired actors in their trailers like Megan Fox and Jonah Hill in the MW3 trailer, and I just feel like they've gone away from the core experience of the game in order to add an entertainment value to to like expand their audience they really made the game uh, they really made the game for noobs and they kind of forgot about the hardcore 15th prestigious like myself I really get to the highest prestige in every game and I really care about prestige but it doesn't seem to matter anymore because people either hack to 10th prestige or people just like they they hate on you for being 20th prestige you really don't get that core gameplay that you should get in a Call of Duty game anymore and right now I'm only like 4th or 5th prestige in, in Call of Duty Ghosts because I'm not enjoying that game I really love Battlefield 4 right now and why should I get to 10th prestige when it doesn't even matter anymore uh, give me something that matters in the game like I don't need duck camo that doesn't matter to me I don't need to pay for all this DLC like Makarov or Captain Price those are awesome characters in the single player but bring them into multiplayer when you can't even see the character you're just in first person view you can't see it other players can see it you get like 10 captain prices running around the map nobody cares about that so why not why not give us something for prestiging like something more maybe a day of double xp for your next prestige or something reward us with something like that in advanced warfare um, change the core gameplay uh, so that it still feels the same but you know you have to improve on it and you have to make it your own I hope Sledgehammer Games doesn't just copy MW3 because they worked on MW3 I really hope that they make it their own and I really hope that they stay away from this thought process of our only fan base is 12 to 13 year olds I really hope they think about the older audience as well and the hardcore fans that have been with them since Call of Duty 4 days so I hope you guys enjoyed this little rant I had don't forget to like me on Facebook to stay updated with the PS4 giveaway and my monster montage thank you for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one peace out guys